uh, Charlene Sievers. I did a couple posts on here, um, I guess, throughout the weekend and stuff like that. So, anyway, I'm less than a week of, uh, I'm not less than a week, I'm a week away of going to Edmonton. And, um, my daughter, like, she's incarcerated and, um, she is due, um, on the 23rd. So, I'm trying to fundraise on GoFundMe, um, got no hits, quite sad, but, um, I'm trying to get out there to get my, uh, granddaughter, my second granddaughter, her name is, uh, going to be Brooklyn Joyce Siebert, um, trying to get out there to get custody, you know, of her, and, um, the story behind it is, um, my first grandbaby uh, I lost uh, a couple of years ago. Um, my common-law husband had a massive stroke, and they thought that I couldn't handle it. So they made their decision that I couldn't, you know, um, take care of him and then take care of my granddaughter. Uh, her name is Treasure. She's going to be turning uh, three in July. So... I'm just asking anybody um, if they could share uh, my GoFundMe site, uh, donate, anything. Um, Like, I haven't even bought anything. Like, I'm going out to Edmonton, and I'm praying and hoping that I do get my uh, granddaughter. Uh, Because i got to speak with social workers, and obviously i got to speak with CFS. And, um, like, I got no background. I got no criminal record. I got I got child abuse check I've done. I'm clear everything. But they have to do what they got to do, I guess. But, yeah. But they denied me last time because of my situation with my common-law husband having that massive stroke. They figured I couldn't handle it. But I'm a strong woman. Of course I can handle it, you know. But uh, if anybody... Please help me, you know, just go to my web, uh, not web, uh, well, it's on Facebook, or GoFundMe, and it's under Charlene Siebert, so I really appreciate if anyone, even share, you know, I really appreciate everything, and uh, God bless you, thank you so much.